hi all uh, welcome to my channel today i am going to discuss about one uh, multifunctional timer as you can see on the display the brand name is finder this is uh, in 87 series the type of this timer is 87.01 uh, in this timer a1 and a2 are the input b1 is the signal 15 16 and 18 are the output or uh, relay points as you can see on the display uh, on uh, top right side we can apply either AC or DC as uh, input uh, for this timer if it is AC uh, it can be 24 volt AC or uh, 240 volt 240 volt AC if it is DC it is uh, we can apply DC 24 volt or uh, DC 48 volt so this is uh, as I told you this is uh, a multi-functional timer mainly we have uh, eight modes of uh, operation that means we can uh, operate uh, this timer in eight different ways uh, a1 that is on delay d1 on pulse g1 sw be ge de ee and permanently permanently on and permanently off so let me show you how to set up uh, each uh, mode uh, please subscribe my channel please like share and comment so let's start the video this is the specification and these are the waveforms of uh, input signal that is u and output that is c and uh, signal that is s and uh, this is the time scales and here we can see the wiring diagram that is without signal and here we can see the wiring diagram that is with signal s is the signal here let me show you how to set a timer this is the mode preset so we can select the desired mode from here and uh, this is the preset for uh, timing so we can select our uh, timing from here here we have uh, timing uh, in a range in between one second to 60 hours for uh, demonstration purpose i am going to select only six seconds uh, but there is no six uh, written on this preset so i will uh, select 10 second from the timer then i will adjust this preset into number six so that i will get six second output in this way we can set our output from 0.5 to 60 hours this is the timer setup here i have uh, used one transformer for providing input voltage to the timer and uh, this is the timer this is the push button switch that is for uh, signal my signal will be uh, this push button switch this is the panel lamp that is for output i have uh, connected this lamp uh, into the output terminals of the timer this is the transformer and uh, these are some mcbs so that i will not get any electrical shock while playing with this stuff these are some connectors first mode is ai or on delay this that is the delay in the timer output to get into on let me show you how this mode works i'm going to set this mode and timing the timer now the main power supply is off here i have uh, set the mode and i am setting the timing now the power supply is off while we set the mode and timing the power supply should be off so now i have uh, turned the power supply into on and uh, you can see that the led is flashing here that means it is counting the seconds 
after 6 seconds the panel lamp will be on now it is on I have a uh, turn off the power supply now I will turn it on again and you can see it is counting for 6 seconds after 6 seconds the output is there so this is how this mode works <coughs> let me show you once again second mode is di or on pulse let me show you how it works i am selecting the mode from here at the moment when the power supply is on the output will come immediately and it will count for 6 seconds then it will be gone this is how the mode is working third one is uh, GI or uh, fixed pulse 0.5 second delay let me show you how it works let me select the mode now the mode is selected and let me turn on the power supply now the power supply is on and it is counting for a 6 second after 6 second the LED will be on for 0.5 second then it will be off this is how it is working that is the time delay 0.5 second delay now the next one is uh, SW or symmetrical recycle recycler let me set the mode from here now let me turn on the power supply so this mode will count 6 second on and 6 second off 6 second on and 6 second off so this mode will be working in this way on and off on and off until we turn off the power supply this is the next mode that is BE this mode is working with an external signal you can see the waveform S that is external signal let me select this mode and I will show you how it works I have selected BE here and this mode is working with an external signal in this case my push button switch is my external signal so when I press the switch the output came up immediately and it is counting for 6 seconds and now it is off so let me turn it on again now you can see the output come came up immediately and it is counting for 6 seconds then it is on if I am giving a constant signal now you can see I am holding the push button now you can see the output is constant it is not counting that means if we give a constant signal the output will be constant and if we if we are giving a pulse then it will be counting for six second and it will be off so this is how this mode is working let me show you again this is the next mode that is ce signal on and off delay there will be a delay on on and off let me select the mode from here now the power supply is off I will turn on the power supply now the power supply is on but nothing is happening so I need to let me try to apply one pulse but it is not working the pulse will not work here I need to give a constant signal now let me hold the push button now the signal is constant and you can see it starts counting it will count for 6 seconds and the output is there and the output is there until I leave my hands if I leave my hand it will again count for 6 seconds and the output will be off so this is how it works let me show you once again
And next one is DE that is signal on pulse. This is just a pulse. Let me select the mode. Now the power supply is off. I will turn the power supply on and I will, I will give a pulse. Now the power supply is on. Nothing is there. Now I have given one external signal, one external pulse. At the moment when I give the external pulse, the output came up immediately and it starts count for 6 seconds, then it off. Here constant signal will not work. We don't need to provide any constant signal. This is working with the pulse. So that is how it works. The next one is EE that is signal of pulse. Let me show you how it works. Now the power supply is off. I am selecting this mode. I have selected the mode. Now the power supply is on and I am going to give and give a pulse. Now I have given the pulse. Now the output came up immediately. It starts counting for a 6 second. Then it off again. Let me show you again. If I hold the switch, it is off. The output will be off as long as I am holding the switch. Next mode is permanently on. Here there is no external pulse. Let me show you how it works. I have set the mode. When I when I turn on the power supply, the output is continuously on and the output will be on until unless I turn off the main power supply. The next one is permanently power permanent permanently off. Let me show you how it works. I have selected the, uh, the mode here and see now the output is off. In this mode there will not be any output. Permanently on means the output will be on for permanently. Permanently off means the output, output will be off permanently. So this is how the timer works. Thanks for watching, please subscribe, comment and like my video, thank you.